neutral shades in interiors beige, cream, white, gray, and natural. When someone decides to go for neutral shades for his interiors, it's very obvious that he wants to play it safe. However, what I want to highlight here is, if you don't mix the neutral colors, whether in the dark shade or in the lighter shade, well, you will end up having an interior space that omits a lot of dull and pale energy, which is not good at all. And today, in this video, I would like to share with you some advices and tips. If you follow it carefully, you will be able to create a dominant bold statement from the neutral shades. At the same time, it will omit important energy for your mood. The energy of passion and the energy of determination. With neutral tones, you have the power of cultivating any style within your home. From modern to vintage, neutral shades can help create that vision. When you are mixing neutrals, you want to decide whether you are going to go with warmer neutrals or cooler neutrals. There is no right or wrong with this. You can choose either one you like. But, you do have to choose only one. For example, if you want a room that feels refreshing and sleek, then crisp white is the shade to choose. It is exactly that crisp. However, beige has a traditional appeal and lightness that makes it a great choice for family homes. Before I give you the tips of mixing neutral shades, I wish to highlight first the benefits of using neutrals in your interiors. Number one, neutrals are visually restful. Your eye will flow from one point to the next in a neutral flavored space without the distraction of a singular color. Number two, neutrals do not hamper decorating taste. So no matter your design style or preferences, there is a place for neutral colors in your decor. Now let's have a look how to mix neutral shades in your spaces to ensure creating interiors that never get old. Tip number one, keep it light. The simplicity of mixing white, cream and beige in this breakfast room keeps the focus on the people you are eating with and the outdoors only cause you don't feel that you are in this decorated room. Tip number two, let the furniture speak for itself. Don't try too hard to make a big splash. If you put your money into furniture and good fabrics, you will get an elegant textural feel. Tip number three. Wood gives depth to any color. Where creams and silvers on dark wood takes on a great shining energy, all while staying elegant. Wood is often all the contrast you need. Tip number four. Use glass while mixing neutral shades. This is a fabulous way to maintain a visually lightweight neutral effect that shines. Tip number five. Texture it. Using textured pieces is key to prevent a neutral room from looking dull. Using neutral shades create spaces that are restful 
soothing, and energizing. If you think neutrals are boring, think again. Here we go. I am sure now I can leave you safe to start using the neutral shades in your interior that will give you passion not only in your whole house but also in each area of your own life. I'll see you again with another color. Bye bye.